the death toll from storms in Texas and Oklahoma in southern U.S. has risen to 19, while the number of missing in Texas has dropped to 12. Two of the dead were initially on the list of those missing, but their identities have been confirmed. Rescuers on Wednesday continued to search for the missing after the storms. Forecasters have said more heavy rains are expected over the next few days. This is now the wettest month on record for Texas. On Wednesday, local police in Midlothian, Texas, told people living downstream from the Pater Dam to evacuate. There was a chance the dam was going to break, but the threat subsided later on Wednesday. Anywhere from 800 to 1,400 homes in Houston have been damaged by the storms. President Barack Obama pledged federal assistance on Tuesday after Texas Governor Greg Abbott declared a state of disaster in at least 40 Texas counties, including Harris County, which includes Houston. On Wednesday, the National Weather Service warned of additional flash floods in Houston and city official urged caution on the roads. Right now we still have a lot of our neighborhoods underwater, Michael Walter, a spokesman for Houston's Office of Emergency Management told NBC's Today program. Two people who capsized in a boat helping with rescues on Tuesday have not been found, Houston Mayor Anise Parker said. Elsewhere in Houston, 100,000 gallons of untreated wastewater spilled at a flooded wastewater treatment plant.